hey you guys if you would like to see how i got this super defined and bomb wash and go with the two dutch braids on top uh using this brazilian keratin therapy conditioner by ogx then keep watching my video Okay, y'all so before i actually got started with this wash and go i did shampoo and condition my hair with these two olive oil products by palmers and i deep conditioned slash did a protein treatment with this acai berry and keratin uh strengthening hair mask by cream of nature and i'm going to use this brazilian keratin therapy conditioner to style my hair today's wash day was mainly like I wanted protein in my hair to do like a protein treatment so I used a lot of products with keratin in it so to get started I actually did split my hair uh, top from bottom well, as y'all can see my part wasn't perfect but that's okay so I'm gonna get started uh, dispersing both sides of my hair with water on the top half as you can see and then I'm gonna go in and detangle both halves Hey y'all, so as you saw in the beginning, the main attraction for this look is the diagonal part uh, in the front, which is why the uh, back half, the part that wasn't perfect, that's why it's okay because that's not the main attraction of this look. So this is pretty much how my hair parted and how it looks. It looks pretty good. After pulling my other side up, I'm going to get started with this side. I just started off with spritzing my hair, getting it pretty damp, and then I'm going to go in with my petal brush and just go in and detangle. So for my base product, I'm going to use this Strengthen and Restore Conditioner uh, by Shea Moisture from the Jamaican Black Castor Oil line. And I want to just work that into my hair. This is a conditioner and my main product is a conditioner. But with my hair, I mean, I can use conditioners and my hair will be perfectly moisturized. And I'm actually going to use the same exact moisture routine all over my hair. The two products that you are going to see. And also... Um, my oil and then my second product i'm using as you saw in the beginning is the brazilian keratin uh therapy conditioner by ogx and i'm using this because uh like i just said um for this wash day i really wanted to focus on protein and y'all know keratin is a protein for our hair and to seal in all that moisture that those two conditioners just gave me, I'm going to put a healthy amount of oil um, and just rub it in, work it in to seal in my moisture. And then I want to go in with my petal brush and just, you know, make sure everything is evenly dispersed and to smooth my hair. Then I'm going to go in with my fine tooth comb and put some gel on. And then I'm going to go in with my hard bristle brush. And as I just mentioned, the last step before actually braiding my hair is smoothing it with my hard bristle brush. And as you can see, I am getting it really smooth. So now I'm going to go in and start braiding. This is not a braided tutorial, y'all. I am not that good at braiding. I can braid my own hair, but I really can't explain it. Um, it I will link my most recent braiding video up above and down below. I try to explain, but it's not too much of a tutorial. But um, yeah, that's pretty much what you see me doing right here. And then in this clip, you're going to see me kind of pull my hair back numerous times like I'm doing right here, just to see how it feels when it's going to be up, how I find it finally finished styling it uh but i just mostly wanted to make sure it was braided out enough so um the whole braid could reach to the ponytail um you will see what i mean later y'all i'm not really good at explaining but yeah and then lastly once i get done with the whole braid i'm going to twirl my uh twirl my hair around my finger just to make a really pretty coil and then i'm going to do the exact same thing on the other side i skipped all the moisture because y'all just saw that but now y'all just see me braiding it up right here
So once I finish with the front, I got started with the back half. The back half is going to be the wash and go. So I first started off with just spritzing uh, this one side with water. Then I'm going to go in and detangle. And once I'm done detangling on both sides, this right here is the final uh, product on how it looked once both sides were was detangled right here <laughs> and then i'm gonna uh start applying my products i'm not gonna show y'all the products as i apply them but right now i'm applying that um jamaican black castor oil strengthen and restore conditioner and then right here is me applying the same jamaican black castor oil conditioner to the other side as you can see my hair really likes it i don't know if y'all can tell but i can tell my hair you know i can see my hair soaking in the moisture and then once i do that i uh just go in with my paddle brush and just make sure everything is evenly dispersed and then right here i'm applying the uh, the brazilian keratin therapy conditioner and then again right here i'm applying the brazilian keratin therapy conditioner on the other side i just wanted y'all to see a better view lastly i'm just applying some oil to seal in all that wonderful moisture and then right here is me just pulling up those two braids and just lightly tying it up with the ponytail with a rubber band excuse me and i just wrapped it around like twice very light so now I'm going to go in and lay these flyaways down and lay my edges. So the first thing I did was just use my uh, toothbrush with some gel, obviously. And just, you know, slick up the sides. And then I'm going to lightly, you know, fix the top. You know, just do them last little minute touches. And then I'm going to go in with my... Um, and then I'm going to actually start laying my baby hairs. Y'all see me doing it all the time. Uh, I do a swoop motion once again, if you didn't know. That's the, really the best way I can explain it. Um, you know, you just got to know how to shape your own face. I do what looks best with my hairline, my face shape. You know how that go. Uh, but yeah, this is me doing it. So after I finish laying my edges, I'm going to go in with uh, these little curl colorful hair jewelries that I got from my local beauty supply store. And I'm just going to uh, apply a couple of those, like five of them, three on one side and two on the other. Basically, what I did was a half up, half down wash and go. And with the top half, as you saw, I just did a diagonal part and did two braids. Um, I think it came out really cute. My edges laid really well, surprisingly. I haven't had this easy of a time laying my edges in so freaking long. But this is what it's looking like. I tested out this product right here by OGX for the first time. This is the Ever Straightening um, in Brazilian Keratin Therapy. I use this because it has keratin in it, which is protein, and my hair, I feel like, needs protein. Um, just, you know, for me doing my hair, that's what I, that's my synopsis of what I think my hair needs. And in the beginning of this video, I showed y'all that I use this acai, acai berry and keratin strengthening hair mask by Cream of Nature. I just used a little pack. Um, I used that before I did the video, obviously. So, clearly, I was just trying to get up on my keratin, get up on my protein. I use this as a protein type of treatment. I know it's a strengthening, strengthening care mask, but the keratin aids in hair repair and acai berries helps prevent damage. And that's pretty much, you know, what a uh, protein, protein treatment does. So I really did want to just, you know, get up on my keratin, my protein. I'm going to try to have a review up of this soon. Um... I gotta just see how my hair comes out. And right here 
even on this product, it says that the Brazilian coconut oil and keratin proteins will help smooth and strengthen your curly or wavy tresses. So I was just, I, I was just going for strengthening and you know, so on and so forth. I really hope my hair dries cute. I'm gonna show y'all how my hair looks in about an hour and a half. I'll give it an hour and a half of air dry time before I put it up and get ready for bed. But no matter how long it takes, I will be back. And uh, yeah. And hopefully, and I'm gonna need y'all to let me know. Do y'all think these little colored hair jewelries do it look too childish? Does it look too youthful? Does it look cute? I'm 21. That's how old I am, so let me know if this looks too childish. Okay, you guys, so this is my hair. I should let it get dry for a few, uh, about an hour or two. It's super defined, as you can tell. I really really like my hair it's super super cute um yeah this is how it looks so i'm actually gonna you know pull it up into a little pineapple and put a bonnet on and go to sleep but i will show y'all how my hair looks tomorrow after my morning class just so you can get a feel on how the dry dry results is although it is about 95 percent dry right now i know y'all want to see i know you want to see how it looks you know completely dry um yeah yeah okay y'all and this is the final dry result uh it's the next day my hair is completely dry pretty much it um but i'm gonna give y'all like a whole overview but i do want to say i do like this product um i used it as a leave-in as y'all saw i like it but i'll give y'all the whole review soon so subscribe to my channel so you won't miss that and yeah so again give this video a big thumbs up if you like it comment down below let me know what you thought or whatever share this video with a friend because this style is cute so do that and then also again subscribe to my channel help me reach 160 that's the small goal we at right now but you know the ultimate goal right now at the moment is 200 so just subscribe to me and make that happen but help me make that happen and i'm going to see you in my next video y'all bye